Okay, Bellator is starting to rev up their engine a little bit. You know, I put a couple of videos out there about Bellator. Nobody's really checking for them. But if you look at those videos, Bellator is revving their engine for something. I'm not sure what it is, but they're definitely getting ready to kind of pop. I hope that this whole change in the network going from Spike TV to, or Spike to um, Paramount doesn't hurt them, but they're finally starting to um, get the wind at their back instead of dead in their face. You know, they finally got the wind at their back. Bellator has put together a welterweight Grand Prix tournament. Welterweight, their best division. Welterweight. That is the Bellator. That is Bellator's um, 155. That's Bellator's Murderer's Row. And it will be. Paul Daly's going to be in it. MVP will be in it. Douglas Lima will be in it. And Rory McDonald will be in it. And this it apparently is supposed to pop off September 29th. This is the same day. Now, okay, September 29th is the same day that we have that crappy ass fight with um, Rampage and um, Vanderlei Silva. But it is what it is. Uh, But it looks like they're trying to stack this card a little bit because they're going to have the Grand Prix on there. And they're also going to have Rory McDonald versus Gegard Mousasi. So Rory's going up to um, see if he can get that belt from Gegard. And then he's going to come back down later on and, um, you know, come back down. I think sometime later on this year, they're placing him into the tournament as well. I'm excited about that. I'm really excited about that. We see how this heavyweight tournament is turning out. Sad thing about the heavyweight tournament, and I hope that Bellator learns its lesson from how they work this thing out, but it's like it just lost all of its steam. It just lost all of its steam. It just kind of puckered out right at the end, right now, and it's not even close to the end. We still got three, two more fights until the championship. So three, three more fights left in the whole tournament. But the sad thing about that heavyweight Grand Prix is that they just, they just stretched it out too long. It was like one fight a month. So in order to get through that first round, the round of eight, you know, it started basically at the quarterfinals. So to get through that quarterfinals, which had eight, P eight, you know, four fights, four months, it took four months to get there. They started the, right now. It's June. They started the tournament in January and we're still sitting here with three fights left. They fucked up with that one. They messed up with that one for real. They really did. I mean, that's that should have been over in three to four months. Three months, four at best. Three, four at the longest. You know, the longest four months. So I really hope that they don't drag this welterweight title, um, this welterweight Grand Prix out. I hope that they don't put John Fitch in it. And I know it's going to be good if they can do that. I know that it'll be good. if As long as they do those two things, it'll be a really good tournament. Glad to see Paul Daly back in there. I'm pretty sure he's excited about the Grand Prix um, instead of the sort of his last fight. It seemed like he, you know, he's coming in. He seems like he's starting to come into all these Bellator fights just upset about something that has nothing to do with the fight. You know, so it's good to see that he might be getting gassed up. He might get gassed up for this fight. He may not. But I feel like, you know, it'll be a good way for him to kind of, you know, get his competitive spirit back. And he's been talking about retiring. So you never know. It might be his time to um put, you know, go ahead and put leave the octagon, leave the gloves in there, leave the gloves in the cage. But I'd like to see Paul Daly around a little bit more. Um, He's such a wily ass fighter. He's just just. You never know what he might do. You know, he might get hit. He might get knocked out. He might get choked out. But he definitely might knock somebody out. He definitely might knock somebody clean out. So um, I'm excited about this welterweight tournament. The Grand Prix is starting September 29th. And I will be watching. And I hope they structure it right. And I hope they don't put John Fitch in it. Like, comment, subscribe.